Protests continued for a second night across the country. People outraged about President Trump's executive orders on immigration. Part of the president's executive order, signed Friday, was halted by a federal judge last night. Responding today in a statement released on Facebook, President Trump said, quote, This is not about religion. This is about terror and keeping our country safe. My first priority will always be to protect and serve our country. Country. But as president, I will find ways to help all those who are suffering." End quote. 325,000 people from overseas came into this country just yesterday through our airports. It's 325,000. You're talking about 300 and some who have been detained or are prevented from gaining access to an aircraft in their home countries and must stay for now. That's 1%. And I think in terms of the upside being greater protection of our borders, of our people, it's a small price to pay. And yet there is outrage nationwide. 17 state attorneys general, including Doug Chin of Hawaii, have spoken out against the ban. He told us tonight he's had attorneys in his office working all weekend, looking at the constitutional ramifications of the president's order and vows that if anyone is being detained in Hawaii, his office will take action. I myself, I, I'm the son of immigrants, Chinese immigrants that, that came to the U.S. after fleeing the communist government uh, back in the 1950s. And, and so um, you know, it, it's, I, I think this is something that is important for all of us in Hawaii uh, to be concerned about anything, anytime something like this happens. I would completely deny the, the idea that, that this is only uh, relating to people's countries and not having to do with a uh, religion. These are Muslim majority countries um, that do not have Trump businesses in them. Uh, there, the, everybody should be able to see that, that really what's happening here um, is a, a very systematic persecution uh, of a certain uh, religious group. And, and so it might not be a, a race right now, uh, but I think the concern about that is, is that if we allow uh, this kind of step to take place, um, next time it will be somebody's race. And, and I think that's, that's the concern. Hawaii's Governor David Ige also opposes the ban, saying in part, quote, Hawaii has a proud history as a place immigrants of diverse backgrounds can achieve their dreams through hard work. We must remain true to our values and be vigilant where we see the worst part of history about to be repeated.